Hey guys, welcome to VidCon day two. I'm here with my dad. Say hi. Um, we're going to a uh, meet and greet for 10 a.m. It's like, oh, it's 10 exactly right now. Uh, so, yeah, we're gonna go meet Megan Batoon. He has no idea who she is, but he's still gonna take a picture with her. Hell yeah. Sounds great. Um, and yeah, I'll update you then. It's a Dodie. Oh, she's a singer. Singer? Yeah. I see her. I'm snooping on her. <laughs> Sandy. What is happening? This is ridiculous. Well, this is a shit show. I mean, what did anyone expect, though? I don't even have a pass yet either. Hey guys, I'm at TanaCon and it just got canceled. Um, so not really a big fuck you to VidCon because this is not good. <laughs> It, apparently, I think it's poorly organized. Look at all these people. <laughs> I guess they've been in line for a while. Five hours. They've been in line for five hours. Oh, fuck. That girl's got a sunburn, too. Um, She's burnt as hell. They've been in line for five hours for an event that's canceled. Uh, we just got here, so I guess we're safe. Um, I guess VidCon definitely won, you think? <laughs> It's not anything versus anything, but yeah, it's been canceled and there's only been like a few events that actually went on I don't know if they overbooked it or something because 20,000 people are definitely not gonna fit in that place No um, So I don't know how the free tickets worked and I don't really know how they paid Surely they would have estimated like how many people they can hold right? You would think. Like this is I mean, I haven't been waiting here for that long, so I'm not really that mad. Sunburned, like but times. like, everyone did not wear sunscreen. I didn't wear sunscreen, but I haven't been there for that long. They've been waiting, like, by the doors and shit, and there's all these line things that aren't very secure. 
and someone's been up on the stage and being like, we're so sorry. Like, people have passes, like they have Tanacon passes, badges, and no one's even inside. I guess there's some people inside because I saw that Tana was still tweeting stuff. So, I don't really know, but people are walking into that door over there and everyone keeps screaming and running and knocking down the barriers. Uh, so we're probably gonna leave because it's canceled, obviously. And hopefully we get, I get my $65 back because um, I didn't even get to go in. <laughs> people are still waiting. Um, I don't know if they're gonna get in. Everyone made it very apparent that it's canceled. Um, VidCon's still open, guys. I don't know who it is. Some random guy. Apparently somebody named Seth. Uh, yeah, it's really hot. They did this in the complete sun, which was a terrible idea. Where's the umbrellas? That's it, right there, that's two. <laughs> What are you gonna do? You ready to go? Yeah, I guess. Or you can hang out. I'll go find shade to sit in. Uh, there's really nothing to fucking do. That guy said it was canceled. He seemed like he knew what he was talking about. Uh, yeah. Because he's got he's got a suit on and he's very official. Okay, so Even people are really like, mad. Like... <laughs> this event is a complete shitstorm. Um, the police are here. I mean, think of, I think they've been here for security reasons, uh, but now we're just trying to find shade and everyone's still got their pass on, so I don't know what the fuck's happening, but everyone's in the shade. Uh, also, I'm guessing I'm not going to go to a meetup now. <laughs> Everyone's over here by the Starbucks and stuff, and by the entrance of the hotel. Um, also, yeah, no. I don't really know what kind of main stage they had, but definitely not enough to accommodate this amount of people. <laughs> hey guys, it's now much later, and I'm actually heading back to VidCon. I just went to the hotel and I ate some Funyuns. I don't know if that's a little TMI. I don't know how that would be. I just felt like talking about it. So I took kind of a break. I watched a few YouTube videos, as you do. Um, and now I'm heading back because um, TanaCon's a complete flop and apparently they're trying to fix it or something and move it to a bigger venue, but I, I don't even know anymore. I don't even know if I want to go anymore. So now I'm just heading back to VidCon and I'm sure everyone else is. So here it is. Heading back to VidCon.
absolutely nobody in this world. I know sometimes it's very easy to think that I do a lot, but no matter where you come from, no matter how far you come, no matter what you do with your life, you are not better than anybody else. And the second you start thinking that you are, you will ruin yourself. One of my favorite lyrics in the world is perspective is a lovely hand to hold. Perspective, having a perspective over someone else's life, what they do, where they've come from, is very humbling. It teaches you a lot. It stops you making mistakes. It helps you learn from the mistakes that you've made. Perspective is very, very important. For every emotion you have, however angry you are, or the sad, how proud you are of yourself, you need to have perspective of how you're making other people feel and where you come from. It's very important. Yeah. Number three. <laughs> Um, I've learned a lot over the last year about friends and friendships and there are a lot of fake people out there in the world, okay? Um, you are going to have some bad friendships in your life. It's going to happen. No one is above it. You are going to experience someone that is going to betray you the second it's beneficial to them. I've had it happen a lot over the last year or so. Um, it's going to happen. Uh, they will come. The snakes will come. The snakes will go. Let them pass through you completely. Be nothing to those people who are horrible to you because that means it's not on you. Always be kind because then you can sleep at night. Okay? <laughs> and number four, the final point before my last song is um, if there's something that you want to do with your life, if there's something you want to try out, uh, you have no excuse. Go and do it. Stop waiting. Stop giving yourself excuses. Uh, because this time next year you will wish you started today. I borrowed that from, from a famous person, I think. But um, if you start today, in a year's time, you'll be so glad you did. If you don't, you will regret not starting today. Stop giving yourself excuses. Stop being afraid of failing and sucking. People are going to tell you you suck every single day. People tell me I can't dance. Guess what? I still do it. Right? Yeah. So if you have something you want to do, just try it. Don't be afraid. Okay? <laughs>